Hey y'all, what's going on? Um, I want to do this little quick story time video because I was just telling, well, the girl I'm talking to now, that I'm trying to get to be my girlfriend. Uh, I told her this story, and I pretty Hey, my fault. Sorry about this, y'all. Uh, just stick with me. It'll be back in just a second. Oh. Um, me, I I'll put it like this. Before then, like, during the summer or fall or whenever, I have a little cousin where, like, we didn't care what season it was. We would still be popping firecrackers. And, um... Like we like it could be snowing on the ground, we still be popping fireworks. Like I don't know where you guys are from, but the people who know in Kansas City, you guys know what black cats are. Oh, they're doing little things where they they're not in mateys, but they're they're still loud. Like the whole neighborhood would be able to hear it. But um anyway. So I remember we and him we used to keep like black cats in our pockets, like in our coat pockets. And um like just in case we wanted to like go outside and we'd be popping them or whatever. So one day while I'm at school, uh, we had this little thing where we like go to different classes. Like the teacher would be with us. We'd like share stories or whatever. One time in the middle of it, like everybody was like going to like different classes or whatnot. I was in my pocket, right? And guess what? I accidentally pulled out my fireworks so the teacher saw me pull them out. mind you guys I didn't mean to pull these out like remember because I told you like I would just have them in my pocket for what reason I don't know but um so the teacher calls the principal well one of the vice principals and he came over and got me like he was just smiling about it but he was telling me to be cautious and stuff um yeah he was telling me like how dangerous this was or whatever and um so of course you know he's gonna call my mama whatever she's in shock because she had no idea and so he was basically telling me that like if one of the students were to like bite on it like the gunpowder or whatever he said something dumb like it could like explode in like the student's mouth he said basically if they were to like chew on one of them they could like they hit cause just like pop just like that and they could be real injured. So, calls my mom and tell her that. And, um, uh, so she comes up there, picks me up. Boy, when I tell you, you, man, I can't even explain the pain I was in. Like, I got my ass whooped. <laughs> like, and mind you, this is only one of the worst whoopings I ever got. Um,. Uh, Man, like I knew, <laughs> I knew to pop firecrackers only in the summertime. After that, trust me. But man, like it, it's funny because whenever you like to, used to do bad stuff, now it wasn't funny then because you used to got whooped down back then. But it's funny now looking back at it. Cause you, you, you be thinking like, bro, why was I so bad? Like, what made me do that? You know, some of y'all know because some of y'all y'all need a whooping to this day. But um, if you guys want, if you got one more story times. Well, actually, you know what? I want someone to start busy. What's up? Anyway, y'all, uh, uh, let me go on because I got the cops on me. But uh, let me know what you guys think. Push comments down below. And uh, I'll see you guys. Keep it fresh. Stay blessed. Start busy out. What you on the phone for? You supposed to be on a job. Get off the phone. I say get off the phone. All right, you don't want to listen? All right, bet. Oh, I can't shoot him. I know what I can do though. Can't I can't okay, alright, whatever. 